once the resources have been assigned to all jobs, the next step is to notify them. So go ahead and click the tab, Notify Resources, to pull up the screen. Again, this screen will default to tomorrow's date. With that, simply go Search. So here are all the jobs that are confirmed and assigned. Now, based on their communication preference that you set up in each reporter's profile, the first three column, print, fax, email, will be automatically checked by RB8. Now, there is a uh, fourth column that says SMS, which stands for Simple Messaging Service, which is basically a text messaging going out to their cell phones. So, if you wanted to notify reporters via a simple text message on their cell phone, uh, go ahead and uh, choose that option also. So, simply right-click and say Check All SMS. This way, you can just simply check all SMS checkboxes. If you have uh, 125 jobs for tomorrow, you don't have to click each box 120 times. Simply use that uh, Check All or Uncheck All option. Now, the good thing about sending a text message to each reporter is that, as you know, you do not want to uh, interrupt the reporter's day while she might be in the middle of that position with a phone call. And uh, also, the signal might be weak up on the high-rise building of law firm, but text message will go through reliably without interrupting reporter's day. And also, uh, she might not get home until late to check email. So sending a text message makes sense to simply let her know that she has a job tomorrow, 9.30, and uh, you will say check email or RB web for more details. On the bottom of the screen, there are two check boxes there. Uh, they are both defaulted checked, and it simply says it will, RB will go ahead and attach all the notice that it can find uh, for these jobs automatically to an, uh, to an email as an attachment. So you don't even have to remember whether you have a notice for certain jobs or not. It will also create a what's called RB Exchange file as an XML file. It will also attach that to the email uh, in case you are uh, notifying the job to another agency who's also using RB, then we electronically exchange jobs using the XML file. So they can simply import directly into RB Calendar without retyping. On the right-hand side is the form name that will be automatically selected for your standard reporter worksheet. This is the format or template that we provided the form manager, the which you can modify uh, to make it uh, more uh, palatable to your operation. And uh, simply you can select, if you have a multiple uh, format, then you can select the one that you want. Now to notify resources, all you have to do simply is simply right-click anywhere on the grid and simply go notify. Once notifications go out, RBA will record under the column called Notified, the date and time these notifications went out successfully. Now, in each uh, co reporting company, uh, you have uh, different policies as to how each resource should respond or acknowledge the job assignment. Now, if you have RB Web, then resources can acknowledge their job either on the uh, RB Web itself on the website or using the mobile version, uh, using their BlackBerry or PDA, they can acknowledge the jobs. And then as they do acknowledge their assignments, the, the, this column acknowledge will automatically have a date and time indicated. Now, if they are doing it manually, either by calling you or by sending the email back, then you need to do it manually by using a, a function built into this screen here called resource call-in. So let's say uh, this reporter just called in, so I'm just going to go ahead and right-click and use the function called resource call-in, and you can simply say, Susan just acknowledged, and you simply go OK. So someone in your firm can be responsible maybe uh, by connecting from home uh, to RB8 to look at this list of jobs for tomorrow 
and look basically looking at these two columns, make sure uh, every job uh, has been notified and every resource called in to acknowledge. So by looking at this and you see that there is a one date and time missing here, so that will be an indicator, a warning flag, somebody has not acknowledged their job assignment.